Now, we occasionally talk about pairing wine with food, speaking of tipping, but this time around we're covering wine and fashion. That's right. GQ Magazine and Penfolds are working together at New York Fashion Week to see how they go together. With New York City Fashion Week in full swing, the worlds of wine and fashion are colliding. No one knows that better than sommeliers, trained professionals who specialize in all aspects of wine service. Joining us today from New York City are Penfold's winemaking ambassador, Dylan Proctor, and GQ Magazine executive stylist, Brett Falgren. Now, gentlemen, I think it's genius to collide these two worlds, but in your uh, <clears throat> expert opinion, why do they make such a great pairing? Well, first off, it's such an exciting time right now in New York. We're right in the middle of Fashion Week, and this morning it was announced that it is, Fashion Week is bringing in over $900 million to the economy of New York, making it bigger than Paris, Milan, and London. So it's an exciting time. There's so much energy here. And it's well known at GQ, we like to talk about how having great style is not just about how you look. It's about living a complete lifestyle, and that includes knowing how to pick out a killer bottle of wine when you're out uh, with a date. So that's really a natural um, partnership with us in Penfolds, and so we came up with a really good contest, and we're just excited about um, working with them. And so, T. Lynn, when we're talking about sommeliers, their style, and, and as we were saying, you know, it's a, it's a lifestyle. It's more than just, you know, how you look or what, what you're wearing. Kind of give us the modern day sommelier's role. In, indeed, I will. You know, and at Penfolds, Australia's leading winery, you know, we think about sommeliers and what they do, how they craft restaurant wine lists, how they craft vintage specifics and variety and, and wine regions and locations. Why not have men and women, male and female sommeliers, actually show us their style, how they craft themselves before they even walk out of the door and step on that restaurant dining room floor? It's all about the women and their great blouses and pencil search pencil skirts or blazers. It's all about men in their three-piece suits, two-piece suits, but yet and still, the modern sommelier is all about rolling up the sleeves in a beautiful cardigan, maybe mm. throwing uh, an, an, a loosened tie with the top two buttons unbuttoned, and you've got your beautiful loafers on and a pair of khakis. It's yeah. all about your style, how you own it, and yeah. how you feel. Not being afraid to take risks. The rules, there aren't many rules anymore. It's just about how you pull it off. Well, and we have a contest that's basically looking for the one that can, like you say, pull it off the best. Tell us more about the contest. We're super excited. This is the second year that we're doing it. Last year we had so many entries. Um, all the sommeliers out there, both men and women, can participate by simply uploading uh, a photo, or actually better, multiple photos, onto their, onto their Instagram or their Twitter feed. And they just need to make sure that they put in the hashtag best dressed som. And we'll instantly see it. Um, I'm one of the judges, along with uh, the designer Rachel Roy and the chef Marcus Samuelson. And uh, we're keeping an eye out, and I give a good hint out there. You want to be creative, um, good attention to detail, and really owning the look are the things that we're looking forward to. Well, and how There's also a website that you can go to as well. Yeah. And I, I can give you the website as well, as well as take your next question. The website is www.pinfolds.com slash GQ Best Dressed Psalm. Well, what I was going to ask is I'm kind of, you know, selfish, so I want to know how can I take some of their fabulous styles and incorporate it into my own life? Well, I like that you're selfish because <laughs> I am a little bit as well. How about you take a bottle of Penfolds Ben 389 Cabernet Sauvignon Shiraz. Incredible wine. It's been around and first vintaged in 1960. You can lay it down. You can drink that wine now. It's got bold flavors. It's tannic. It's big. It's full body. But it also has black and blue fruit characteristics that I think you'll like very much. So you'll have great style just by having the wine there with you. Indeed. Well, gentlemen, I am living vicariously through you as you enjoy New York Fashion Week, as you're having some fabulous wine, and as you're doing this amazing contest. So thank you for taking a minute to talk to us. Thank, thank you. you so Thanks much. for having us very much. Don't go anywhere. The Morning Blown will be right back.